in the module info file, you can use the exports directive to specify which packages within a model should be accessible to other models. By default, no packages are accessible unless you explicitly export them. For example, let's say we have a model called model A and it requires model B. Model B also requires model C. A depends on B and B depends on C. So A has an indirect dependency on C. Generally, if A does not directly need any package in C, then just having A require B in its model info file is just fine. But what if A also needed to access features in C? By default, this will mean you have to add requires C to all A models. Now this can be redundant because after all, A requires B. So what if we made it in such a way that as A requires B and because B requires C, A should have access to C. We can achieve this by using the transitive keyword. The transitive keyword is used with the exports directive to ensure that any model requiring the current model also implicitly requires the models specified in the transitive relationship. Let me explain with example. For example, model B will now include the transitive keyword. So it requires transitive model C. C is now required as transitive. So any model that directly requires B will automatically depend on C. Since model A requires model B, it will now have access to model C because of the transitive use. This saves developers the stress of having to list all the required dependencies for each model. And it reduces the complexity of model descriptors. However, there's an important note to take off. When a model A requires another model B transitively, any model that directly depends on model A will also implicitly depend on model B. However, transitive dependencies do not extend beyond that level, meaning that it will not propagate further down the chain. Let me give an example. Let's say model A requires transitive B, model B requires transitive C, and model C, you have some code and dependencies. Let's create two more models, D and E, where D requires A and E requires D. In this scenario, model D implicitly depends on model B because model A requires model B transitively. However, module E will not implicitly depend on module B or C since the transitive dependencies do not propagate beyond direct dependencies. If you want model E to implicitly depend on model B and model C, you will need to explicitly use the transitive keyword in the model descriptor for model D. Now, when model E depends on model D, it will also implicitly depend on model A, B and C.